So as the people who have now been behind three Captain America movies, Yes, indeed. What was the best thing or most interesting thing you discovered about his emotional journey? Or Bucky's? Bucky's well, more it, emotional one, really. It was nice in this movie to have him make a personal choice. Because he's the guy who chooses the greater good over, yeah. over uh, you know, and he's kind of selfish motivation. But this time, you know, he can be accused of being selfish, whether or not he is 100%. You know, he has, he's fighting for the greater good in the uh, Accords question, but when it comes to Bucky, he's like, you know, you know what? This is the last person I know from my old life, yeah. and I'm not going to let him go. Wink once for soul and once for time. And, and, uh, and, no and it doesn't mean anything. Yeah, no. Uh, I think it's okay to say it's a stone free movie. Is it is a right? stone yeah. free movie, <laughs> which I think is a Jimi Hendrix reference. Okay. All right, and more or less characters in Captain America Civil War than will be in Infinity War. Uh, less. Less. This is, a, this is a walk in the park. Yeah. By comparison, is yeah. there really, does that chart of the characters really exist? That's yeah. been fabled? Oh, yeah. It is. It not only exists, it gets gets bigger as they make more movies and then you go, do we have to put all these people in? And they say, yes, yes, you do. Um, no, they're magnetic cards on a magnetic board. And you can throw them from across the room? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That guy? Dead. Plenty of tantrums. <laughs> so what do you want people to most look forward to in this episode? What can you this yeah. I mean, I think. It's, I mean, I, I think it's a really, if I can say, a really effective combination of, of surprisingly effective drama that never takes itself so seriously that you can't laugh. Because it is funny, pretty all the way through. And ridiculous Russo brother action. Love it. It's crazy.